welcome our doll BFFs. Welcome to our channel, Nene and Sophia. If this is your first time here, we are a doll channel. Um, we do some unboxing and we need to be working on a video for our uh, we, our mini verse. Um, mm -hmm. we, we have a little series called Sunny Days that we do too. And we haven't done any for a while because they are a lot of work. <laughs> and um, But we are working on one that we're going to do too. And mm -hmm. um, I'd like to get to where we're doing some crafts, but um, I don't know exactly how to like sometimes do some of that stuff on camera. So I'm working on that too. Today we are going to talk fashion. We have some fashion from um, different places. We've got some of the um, newer Mattel fashion packs. Um, they've been out a little while this summer and we've got a little small haul from Timu and we have um, a Rainbow High. Some of the Rainbow High fashion packs are already going on sale. Um, I think they're originally like $7.99 and some of them are $5, $4 kind of in there. So I've been kind of keeping an eye out seeing if maybe they would yeah. I, we have rainbow high, but, yeah. um, so it's like, you know, I know that they'll fit all my rainbow high, but they might be able to, um, some of the other dolls might be able to wear Maybe. some of the fashion too. So I don't know how much we're going to get through here. I, we don't want to go on all day. Um, but so we're, we're just going to look at, at some of these fashion and tell you where we got them and about how much they cost. Okay. So you see Midge standing here, hanging out with us. Um, she said that didn't look very good. It looked kind of like a maternity top, probably because of the stand. But um, I had already opened this Mattel fashion pack because I wanted um, this dress for Midge for a photo that I was taking of my life in the dream house dolls. And so um, these new fashion packs come with two That's outfits. My I think this might be my favorite fashion pack out of the new ones this summer. Um, not just necessarily this outfit, but... I feel like sometimes, um, well, I kind of like the blue one too, but sometimes I'm Mattel gets a little crazy with their color combos, mm -hmm. and sometimes they don't make sense to me. Like, there was that small fashion um, pack that had, like, a plaid top and a little plaid skirt, but they were, like, different colors of plaid, and I'm like, well, I don't have to be super matchy-matchy, but that just... Well, it depends what color of plaid, because some kind different of, colors of plaid look like <coughs> Well, that's, plaid. well, this didn't. They were, uh, I'll have to find that sometime and show you, but they were kind of, you know, some, we know that, like, sometimes Barbie fashions mm -hmm. anymore are a little clashy, and um, I like, I like teal and pink together. I think that that's a really pretty combo. I always like pink um, orange, and red, orange. Yellow. Um, so this is, this is one of the dresses that came in this fashion pack. And it has a texture to it and kind of a cottony feel. It's a nice feeling fabric. It doesn't feel super cheap. There's elastic here, uh, Velcro's in the back. It does have some room in it. Um, I'm not sure how this would do on our curvy girls, but there's definitely room down here in the bottom of the skirt of the dress. Okay, and um, we'll, we do have a couple of made to move models here that we can show you. So I'd like to put some of that on one of our model. And this is one of the other fashion packs um, that Mattel has out. These run about, Those are well, I like anything that has the little Barbie B on it. <laughs> I think that that's really cute. These have two outfits in them and some accessories, but I'm noticing that this is the only one so far that I've purchased that has shoes. Um, you know, all Barbie fashion packs used to come with shoes. I mean, our Barbies need some shoes. So they do have well, accessories. You can get fashion packs just of shoes. I, yeah, but you know, it's nice that they come and they match and they look good with the outfit. Mm -hmm. But um, we're going to open these and put um, some of these okay. clothing. Well, we'll just start out with these two. Okay. We'll start out with these two Mattel, put them on our models, and see how they look. Yeah. Okay. Okay, for the pink and teal, we already showed you Midge, and this is the other part of the set. She comes with this really cute bag that is hard, not soft at all. Then she comes with this. Well, she, no, the pack comes with. Yeah. Not the doll. Yeah. Then the pack comes with this cute little crop top. It has bunnies. It has some leaves and stuff and a cute little like bow. And it comes, it attaches in the front. 
Then you got these cute little boots with like some sort of flower and a butterfly. Then, which I don't think really set the mood, are these boots. What kind of shoes would you have rather had? Some heels or some sandals or sneakers? Or? Maybe just some cute little sneakers. Pink, mm -hmm. something sneakers. I said it does look sort of kind of summery, you know, the colors the and stuff. Really and the boots kind of... look like snow boots. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> like, do something maybe like a cute, like, sneaker or something. Like yeah. That's really cute. But the, the boots would still be cute for something else. And then I opened the the blue pack. Um, what One thing I did want to say is these outfits are the recycled plastic. The materials that make the outfits are from recycled plastic. Mm -hmm. And they kind of have changed up their their outfit packaging. Um, is a different kind of plastic. It is still resealable, but it doesn't have, you have to kind of cut the top off. And it still has like a little hanger there on it, but I had to kind of cut that off to get it to get it open so you could still use those bags but they're not like the other bags that we had that were a little bit more um heavy duty okay so um i thought this was a skirt until i took it out so this is um a little pair of shorts that have the barbie b and then a little crop top and a lighter blue both velcro in the back uh, the top has a ribbon. It's a little big on the shorts. Right. I, I brought the Velcro all the way over in the back, but you can see that there is um, a big... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If she... Those, those could be her uh, eating pants, right? <laughs> <She's>, yeah. <laughs> her Thanksgiving shorts. But um, maybe it would fit... Maybe we can try this on a curvy because yeah. maybe these shorts would actually fit on maybe. a curvy. I used my curvy to model the other part. Which looks so cute on her. Of the outfit, which is the dress and t-shirt combo. This is all made together. Um, the t-shirt is made in it. It's not a separate piece. And it Velcros all the way down to the bottom. So the whole back of this opens up. It's a little snug right here. I almost didn't get that together, but it came together and it looks, you know, you, you, I don't think it's that noticeable. It looks fine. One thing, I wish this was like more put, like more like It kind less, of po pokes out. Yeah. I wish it was more fitted mm -hmm. than that. Um, but from that, I think it's really cute. It does have... It has a seam running through here, but it's not, and and maybe that's, it's a really stiff fabric. Yeah. Um, and maybe that's why it kind of pops out like that and doesn't really lay flat. It's not hemmed. It's got a seam that's actual thread, but it's not hemmed there. So um, it, it is hemmed on the bottom. So I don't, I don't, yeah, yeah. I agree. It doesn't really lay down too flat. Um, okay, so what are we going to try next? Maybe we should open the other fashion pack. It has some cute, like, pinks, ready pinks and yellows. Maybe okay. some blues with it. And, and we did get some, um, Timu things. One of the things that I was just going to show you real quick that's not fashion, but I thought I... I really do try to look at the measurements on things when I order them. And I thought that these were like little baskets with plants that I was going to put in my new little bookstore that we've been working on. And I got them and they're really quite large. So I was thinking, well, maybe I could set these like out on the sidewalk outside of my bookstore. But you can see that they're like not like little tiny baskets that are gonna fit on the shelf. Yeah. Um, most of what I got was like some swimsuits, some summer type things. So I got this Ken pack, um, a kind of surfing swimsuit um, item. So I will try this on one of our made to move kins. All right, so I like this Ken outfit. I don't feel like I paid more than $4 for any of the little packs I got. Um, and this one was pretty cute. Um, it came with three pieces. It has a ribbed t-shirt, this Velcro's in the back, and it does feel like t-shirt material. And then yeah. it has this silky um, Hawaiian kind of looking shirt on the outside. There's no closures on this. Um, it's got a few 
um, strings that need to be cut off here at the bottom, but it is it is hemmed all the way around. The collar's hemmed. And then these shorts that kind of look like a gray denim, but they're um, kind of a silky material, but they have Velcro. They're all hemmed. It comes with a little plastic surfboard and it came with a white pair of shoes. And <laughs> Sophia's like, you only got one pair of shoes on there. And that because I was forcing them on, um, you see his heels not all the way down in there. And it's kind of like the sides are kind of bulging out. So these shoes did not really fit him very well on the made to move body. Um, but it did come with a pair of sneakers. Maybe I can use them on um, another doll, but they didn't really fit on him very well. But if he's out surfing, he doesn't, he doesn't need shoes on. But I'm really very happy with this outfit. This good. was a good one because sometimes, you know, we know that when we order things from Timu, it's pretty cheap. And we're like, yay, it's cheap. But then when you get a lot of stuff that you can't use or that's not well made, it, it's still, you know, a waste of money is a waste of money. So, um, but this one's, this one's very cute. What did, oh, and I wanted to say from the, the blue outfits that we just looked at, the, I forgot to say that it came with a little pink pair of sunglasses and a little square purse. Cute. Okay. The other pack. So the first outfit came with a cute little yellow necklace with a cute heart, which is really cute. Maybe we could add like. A Do some painted like details or something. something. Yeah. The top was, you definitely had to pull it a bit to be able to fasten it. It's a little tight, but then these bottoms fit extra really well. They're Which are stretchy. cute. They have what a really do they feel like? Pattern. That's kind of a nice, those feel nice. This felt really stiff, but these so have these, a nice feel these to These ones are nice. This one's nice. Then the other set I love with. Oh. Because this is like such a like me outfit thing. So she's got some cute heart sunglasses, which I do have heart sunglasses. And then a cute little sweatshirt. I like I like that shirt. That's and pretty. And then a skirt. I love wearing sweatshirts and just some skirts because I feel like it looks cute. So Yeah, I like that. Now nice. see, I would have probably been like and this is what I'm talking about. I probably would have been like, okay, just a plain denim skirt or a plain pink skirt or something. I think or white. But see that none that of it. If that was like a top and then with these bottoms, that would be Yeah, cool. like this top. Yeah. 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 But see, because... this doesn't really go with, you know what I mean? That's kind of crazy looking, yeah. that top with those. It's got some of the same colors, but that's a lot of pattern. But yeah. But like I said, that's how like Mattel Cute. Cute kind of though. does things. Well, those were our three. Uh, Mattel fashion packs. Um, there is one more out there, like a kind of mermaidy little dress mm. that I um, we might go ahead and and I, you know, when you wait and then like later on, fashion packs get pretty expensive. So um, you know, if it if it does happen to go on a sale first or something, or Prime Days are coming up, um, I'll keep an eye out for that little mermaid one because it was cute. But I think my favorite was the the teal and the pink. Really. Um, I think, well, this set, this, this pink and teal set, I really, really liked it. Um, I really liked the pattern on this and I really liked all the blue and kind of yeah. denim color, but I was kind of disappointed in the feel of this fabric yeah, on this set. Yeah, that's rough. So, um, we still have some more stuff here. We've got, um, I ordered especially a lot of little swimsuits for the dolls. So we'll try a couple of those on and I have a little short set for Ken. So we'll, all right. You want to show, um, this was a Timu outfit. Like I yeah. said, I probably like three bucks. I don't feel like I, um, usually I'm kind of cautious about like getting ones that are too expensive. Cause I, you know, you don't know what to yeah. expect. So it came with a cute little butterfly necklace with a cute green top. It came with a bracelet. I like how they're shiny. Like yeah. they're really made out of silver. I mean, obviously they're plastic, but they don't look plastic. Then the shorts were kind of tight. I think they'd fit better on like Skipper or a Petite doll. And then black cute, heels. I think 
white sneakers would have been a little better, but because it's like kind of a summery outfit, and I think white would go better with like the light green or the light blue. So, okay, what I like about this is all of this outfit is has a hem in it. Um, the shorts are denim and they have a little cuff and everything is hemmed. Um, and the shirt has like a it's a little silky but kind of a cotton feel to it. So I think that that's a really cute, that's a really cute outfit. Yep. Um, I'm very, very pleased with that. Now I got this outfit for my can. I'm not as happy with this as I was my little surfing outfit. So on a regular made to move, I mean, these like look like, I don't know, Nene used to have these things when she was little, like they were kind of shorts and a skirt and they, I don't know, we called them culottes and stuff. I mean, it's like, they're so like, I was thinking maybe on our buff can, Maybe he would fill them out a little bit, but I mean, they're just so like loosey goosey well, and they have look like a crop top. Right. And they have all these <laughs> gathers and stuff. So these are super big. This is, you know, just the regular size fella. I don't think I did my Velcro lined it up correctly, but it's Velcros in the back and it does feel like t-shirt material, but very thin. Um, it is hemmed, but it's like so short, like... Yeah. Like, you know, what it's t-shirt. Barbie should... wore that? Well, and maybe, she, and maybe Barbie could wear this because I even feel like, <laughs> I even feel like the neck goes up, you know, kind of almost looks unnatural. Like the neck's too tight. It's too short. Um, yeah. The shorts are t way too baggy. Like, look like, I don't yeah, know. That one's kind of a disappointment. Looks like balloon shorts Two here. out of ten. I mean, they feel nice, like I said, and they're hemmed, but they're just not a good fit. Two out of ten. Um, now, um, I don't think I paid more than $2 for any of the swimsuits. I did, I didn't get them in a big pack of swimsuits cause I, um, just picked out some individual ones, but they were about two bucks, I think. And I think this one's pretty cute. That this one little two cute. piece. I mean, it's just kind of simple, you know, Velcros, the top Velcros in the back. It's got some elastic, um, the little bow in front, but I thought that was cute. Yeah, that one is very cute. For some of our summer photos and things like that. I, I like that. Okay. Um, let's show them this package for this Rainbow High. Um, like I said, some of the fashion packs have been on sale. And I was thinking I got this one for like $4. So we'll try it. We'll try to see who we can get this to fit in. We know it fits on Rainbow High. So we'll see if we can get it to fit any of the other dolls. Of course, I never can get the shoes to fit. Um, and it has like a tiara that's really big for the rainbow high heads. If they, ha they might fit Bigfoot. Pardon? That <laughs> girl with big feet. Oh, uh, well, we do. Bigfoot. Yeah, we do have some Barbies <laughs> with big feet. But I think those are still too. Those are really big shoes. So, um, and then I've got a couple more um, little Timu items here that we'll... Okay. I think we're going to finish off now with our fashion and fashion packs. Most of these are swimsuits from Timu, and then we do have the little rainbow high um, to show you. So, we dressed Lily up in a cute little bracelet. And Lily is not a, a made, made to move. I mean, she's an older fashionista, but I thought that that okay. was pretty cute with the little skirt, and then it's got the bottom. Um, the ribbon is kind of big for my like it just creates a really big bow and i feel like we wouldn't wear overly big bow so that's but i said that's an easy thing to cut off yeah, you know because yeah. it's not really even hemmed on the end so we could we could slice that off yeah okay Ooh. um this is another um and that was timu this is a timu um on a made to move I don't think it would fit, uh, it, you know, would not go on anything any bigger than this doll um, because the pants are, you know, I mean, they fit nice, but they're pretty snug. But I like kind of the the boy short uh, swimsuit kind of style, just a little bit something different. Um, it does not have, and sometimes they, they're Velcro, they don't sew it all the way around, and then it doesn't want to stay you know, flat. So, um, when I, when I do sew doll clothes, I make sure that I go all the way around the Velcro so it doesn't do this. 
And this is sewn together up here. So I had to take it over her head and bring it down and then Velcro that in the back. Okay. Do you want to show them that one? Okay. So now we got our rainbow height. We tried a made to move, a skipper, and then finally it fits Stacy. They have, what were we gonna say? Like such. Um, well, they have, big heads. They have big heads, but they're, so but rainbow they're, high are shorter in their like torso. Shorter. Yeah, so it looks really cute on her. It's so sparkly. I know. And I also love the accessories. Obviously, the shoes won't fit, but they're still cute for maybe a rainbow highs. Mm -hmm. The bag has rainbow high written on like the ribbon or anything, but it's still cute. So like you could have your dolls go rehearse or something with that. Then you got like a rainbow high ballet company that has things. It, it's written in like a different language or just like. Is it? Yeah. That's oh. not our language. Or they might have just like typed random things. That's kind of cute, like a little program for the yeah. dance recital. And then we got the crown for Rainbow High, which might actually be cute for Rainbow High, but definitely won't fit our dolls. And then we got cute little. Um, it's I don't like know a little prop called. that you'd yeah. use in the. I wonder if it. In the dance. Works. Now see if these are like maybe on Prime Day or something if they're on sale. Um, like I said, I think I. Got this from walmart.com for $4, but then I looked again, um, I was looking for some other sales on there and it said they were out of stock. But at $4, you could get a couple of them, which would be the same as the original price, and you could have a couple of your dolls doing a recital together. Yeah. That'd be a really cute photo. Um, okay, so we're gonna finish up with these last two swimsuits. Uh, this is from Timu, and I thought this one was really, really cute. Um, it does have, you know, kind of a big bow here in the back too. And it came with a wrap, but really that's just like a, <laughs> like a, a scrap of fabric. There's no hem or anything, but you know, it probably, if you tied that on or whatever, that would look, you know, kind of cute on her. Now this last one was a little disappointing because, and it came with a little wrap as well. But I think the swimsuit itself is really cute. And it Velcroed in the back, has a nice fit. This is all hemmed up, hemmed around here. But they sewed the neck piece together. And obviously it's not gonna go on over her head like this. And I can't put it on her head first and then take her legs through it. <laughs> Are you consoling her? Okay. Um, so, I mean, I, I can salvage it. I just need to snip a couple stitches there and put a piece of Velcro on it. But you know, if coming as it is, you can't get it over her head. Um, I got something from dollar store like that one time. I was like, what am I supposed to do? What are you supposed to do with that? Um, so that one wasn't really well thought out. It needed a little piece of Velcro or something or a hook or a tie or something there. But other than that, it's a cute little one piece swimsuit. So I think that that is all of our fashion packs for today. Yeah. We had uh, some Rainbow High, which, you know, kind of keep an eye out on some of those. Those are going on sale. And we had um, a lot of swimsuits from, from Timu. And we had some, a little bit of Kin Fashion from Timu. One I really liked, one was a little disappointing. <laughs> yeah. Um, but, uh, oh, and our fashion packs from Mattel. Soft. Her hair is very soft. So, um, if you like to look at doll fashion, um, please join us for more videos. Um, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring that bell. And um, remember that no matter how many trips you've taken around the sun, take time to play and have some fun. You can also find us on Instagram at Nene underscore Sophia. And until next time, this has been Nene. This has been Sophia. See ya! See ya.